Fumon keeps on uh, persisting to bring blinding rainfall across northern Luzon and central locations of the Philippines. These are some pictures throughout the day today. We're exp expecting this to make landfall anytime soon over the northern tip of Luzon, possibly making its way out in into the water, becoming a severe tropical storm due to the water being a little bit warmer than norm, about uh, two degrees ab above the normal range, and then making its way towards Taiwan, possibly making it to the islands of Okinawa as a typhoon status. So this is likely to intensify even further. Right now, it's packing gusts of 125 kilometers per hour, and it is moving at the speed of 20 kilometers per hour. And it is likely to drop more heavy rain, total of about 500 millimeters. And anywhere along the path of it, about 150 to 300 millimeters. Certainly, flooding will be at huge risk. Where we really want the precipitation is down towards Indonesia, where the fire is raging. We have some picture foreseeable future. We're not really seeing the winds uh, happening to change the direction, calmer conditions, and we're likely to see afternoon thunderstorms due to the tropics weather. Well, this usually happens, but not enough to contain the wildfires, so the smoke could still last for the next couple of days. Here across Texas and New Mexico, we're still seeing the surge of the moisture, and this is the remnant of Odile, which was used to be a Category 4 hurricane that hit Baja California. Well, the flooding could still be at high risk, 70 millimeters of additional rainfall will be likely. We're still tracking Polo and we still have a tropical storm warning in place here so please watch out if you are in these vicinities. Severe thunderstorms could happen across the Gulf states and then out towards the north we're looking at some frost uh, so the temperatures will be below freezing mark in some locations in Quebec and the New England. All right a quick look here in Europe a spiral of clouds still lingering here it's a cutoff low so it will be staying here throughout your weekend. The British Isles, the Iberian Peninsula, and then into France, we're likely to see some high risks of severe weather, which includes some tornadic activity, which cannot be ruled out. The temperatures are as followed in Glasgow at 18 degrees with cloudy skies. I'll leave you now for extended forecast.